forgetting I'm doing this. So after food, we what did we do after that? We went to a showing, an anime we went, showing. We went to go. Uh, I don't remember what it was supposed to be, but after like two minutes, it froze. It froze. So we were watching a wooden floor. So we stayed and watched that lovely wooden floor for about five minutes before we went across the Best across show the ever. Shut up. Uh, before we went across the hall to watch Fairy Tale, which just happened to be on, so that was very amusing. And then what did we, we had the little broken remember. escalator. Yeah, there's a there's an escalator that broken apparently broken down is, restroom. Yeah. And then we decided uh -huh. to go see the gaming area. We did. We went to the gaming area because the con or the panel that I wanted to go to was apparently full because I didn't get in line soon enough. But no, I have no idea what we're doing because we're just kind of wandering. And I don't think we're going the right way, so I will check in again soon, as soon as we figure out where we are, because this is a very large convention, so bye guys! Randomly checking in from the dealer's room as we wander about, because Derek's looking for something that he says now is vanished. I swear it vanished. So we're just going to wander until we find things. And hope I don't spend the last of my money because, yeah. Wandering in circles. For the record, this is what happens when you let men lead you around. So, we're just kind of killing time because there's not really any panels we want to go to at the moment. Well, that I want to go to because he's just kind of tagging along. But we're obviously, as you can see from the lovely background, wandering around the food court. Waiting for him to decide what he wants to eat. I'm not hungry. I'm not hungry anymore. See? See? Men are... Yeah. Just nah. Um... You love me. I do love you. Um... So yeah, there's a panel at 7 that I'm like dying to go to, so... I'm probably going to abandon him here in a few minutes just to go stand in line for that panel just so I can make sure I get in because there was another panel that I wanted to go to that we got closed out of. We was really disappointed because, again, it was another one that I really wanted to go to. And people have stopped me to ask for pictures and I've remembered to take my glasses off. So I'm very proud of myself for that. Where are you going? I don't know. To complete this circle again for the second time because he's I don't even know and there was something else I was going to add in this next update that I don't remember you just missed him I just missed who? Uh, the twins the host club <gasps> I missed them they're right over there sitting on the table I don't right want to I'm not going to disturb them while they're eating. That's rude. <laughs> and we're almost out of the food court, so we're almost to uh, no longer dying and bumping into people. This is like the most crowded con I've been to. This is like the biggest con I've been to, to be honest, which is really weird. I was expecting it to be about the equivalent of Colossicon. It actually is a lot bigger. The dealer's room is huge. Artist Alley is amazing. Uh, the panels fill up really fast, so that's something that I'm kind of disappointed in. And there's also not that many that I've wanted to see, but I heard someone call out to me, and I don't know where they went now. Huh? This is what happens when you're not paying attention at a con. Oh well. So, we're going to figure out something to do, and then we'll go to this next panel, and we are not going to stay till tomorrow, so I will be wrapping this up either in the next check-in or one after that, so it'll depend. So. This is what happens at cons. This is <laughs> We're trying to find our way out of the con and I've 
come to a conclusion. You can never leave. Ah, bad lighting, horrible lighting. We found the car. We finally made it out alive. Are you trying to like get in this car? He doesn't know how to get in a car safely. So it's freezing. I'm going to re-emphasize my do not wear a summer cosplay in the middle of January if you live in Ohio or any place that has snow in the middle of January. So we are going to be heading home because we cannot afford the hotels down here. Um, and I was still kind of up in the air about whether or not we were coming, so I didn't book ahead like I normally do. So next con will probably be a little bit longer, will probably be more than one day unless it's only a one day con. Um, I haven't decided on where I'm going yet, but I will keep you guys posted and definitely expect some con vlogs in the future. So bye now. Mwah. Hey guys. Um, so I was a little unhappy with where I left it, so I'm doing a little in addition to everything. Um, and I completely just blanked on what I was going to say. But, um, I am going to get up and get the con spoils, which I showed you guys the picture that I got at Artist Alley, but I don't think I showed you my lovely new bag. Look at how adorable this is. I have it, I have it being used and everything. But look. I'm going to empty everything out here real quick so it sits right. Um, and once again, that lovely picture. Oh, I love art like that because it's just so pretty. And this one is so detailed and really, really pretty. Um, but here is the awesome bag that is now my con bag. As I think I said when I was doing the beginning of this, the con bag was like my goal for this con, was to get a con bag because I didn't really have anything and I was just carrying my purse or like grabbing a random bag and now I have an official con bag that has a cute little kitty 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 cat on it and it's so cute and I love it and it's wonderful. Um, and yeah, so I am like ready to crash. Um, was there anything else I was going to add? Overall, I had a blast at OhioCon. I wish I would have been able to get a little bit more um, videos, but I kept forgetting I had it um, and that I was going to do it. And it was also really crowded there, which is kind of something I didn't, I don't want to say I didn't expect, which I think part of it was that there was some construction on the hotel, which I don't know if some of the shots you could see it or not. Um, but that kind of put a damper on things and made it a little bit more difficult to get around. Um, I learned quite a few lessons from this con. Uh, one is to put padding in the bottom of your shoes because my feet hurt a little bit. Um, I have, of course, new boots because, you know, I'm, I'm not the brightest crayon in the box. Um, and definitely bring a wig comb, which I actually was looking for mine this morning and for some reason couldn't find it. So it's somewhere among all of my cosplay stuff, which needs to get organized. So there's that to look forward to for me. Um, I don't know which con is going to be next on my list. I really don't. I have a list of cons that are potentially going to, but um, it also depends on getting off work and where I'm at financially, so it's it's going to be iffy for a little while. Um, I am definitely going to be at Glass City. I'm working on a special non-American con, so I'm really, really, really hoping to, get to go to that. Um, I'm not going to say what it is yet, just because I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to go or not yet. Um, and there's a couple others that I'm going to check into because, um, I don't know if I've, by the time I post this video, I would definitely post in my cosplay bucket list, which has going to a con in every single state, which I'm hoping to start on this year because technically I've gone to a con in Ohio and I can very well cross that one off the list because I've gone to a few in Ohio actually. 
Um, and I think that's pretty much it to sum up the lovely journey. I will probably definitely be going to OhioCon next year if everything works out. I will probably plan a little bit better and actually get the hotel and have my cosplay done on on time this year and I'm running out of time on my recording thing so um, I hope anyone who I saw at the con or who was at the con had an awesome time because that is what it is it's making friends and having a great time and making things better and my phone is yelling at me so I will add on to that at a later time maybe in a different video um, so, this is Ray, and I am officially signing out. Good night, guys.